Now folks showed up across 11 early voting sites in Jefferson County today to cast their ballots. 12 News reporter James Grant was there talking to voters about their experiences. Long lines were the headline this morning at some Jefferson County early voting locations as county residents took their place in line to cast their ballot for the upcoming elections. I'm kind of lost for words right now, to tell you the truth, but uh, everybody need to come out and vote. It's real serious right now. That's about all I pretty much y'all can say right now. Early voting locations such as Rogers Park and Theodore Johns Branch Library saw long lines of early voters this morning, some of them waiting since 6 in the morning to vote. For most, the voting was the easy part. Everything was smooth sailing, had no problems whatsoever. They had a few little glitches, but everything went smooth. As the day went on, lines did dwindle down in some spots, but regardless of how long the wait was, the right to get out and vote was not taken lightly by early voters. It's a, it's a privilege and an honor and a, a freedom that we uh, cherish, and here we are. We're, we're exercising our right to vote and voice our opinion in a very peaceful way. I just want to say that, you know, a lot of people suffered and died uh, for our right to vote, so I'm out here, you know, honoring that. Other early voting locations, such as the Jefferson County Precinct 1 office in China and the Marion and Ed Hughes Public Library in Nederland, were fairly quiet this afternoon and didn't see as much foot traffic. For those that did show up to vote earlier today, their message was pretty clear. Get out and vote today. Vote, vote, vote. Also important to note, at each early voting location in Jefferson County, most voters were social distancing and wearing masks, both indoors and outdoors. In Beaumont, James Grant, 12 News.